see a lot of questions emailed to me and also a lot of confusion online about editing particular ranges, especially in vocals of audio. So maybe you wanted to bump up a little bit of a phrase or a, lo- a word or, or take it down for a plosive to make it fit with it better within the mix. And there's a lot of confusion of how this could be done inside of Cubase. So let's go ahead and take a look at our scenario. I'm going to open up just my uh, automation panel, and you can do that by hitting the F6 key. And then I'm just going to write some automation uh, from the start to the end of the automation here for our track. So let's say I haven't found a value yet. I want to search for that value. I let go. And now we're going to have a point at the beginning and at the end of the project to come back to. So if I wanted to do a uh, particular editing and bring out one word, perhaps I see a lot of people doing this technique where they feel they have to enter in four points. So you could kind of click here and we'll zoom in just on this one particular phrase. And then they want to create more points and kind of drag these down like so just to do that. And that is incredibly tedious to do. But there's a much faster way of doing this inside of Cubase. So I'll just undo that. And what we want to do is to use the line tool. So we can see our line tool selected here. And I'm going to just choose to do a square wave. And what I could do is just hold down the shift key. And now as I move the mouse, if I wanted to do this word right here, hold down the shift key and drag across, it'll just automatically do my automation bump right there. Or if I wanted to do just this phrase uh, down a little bit, again, hold down the shift key and you could just do your little automation tweaks just like so. So again, very simple to do it this way. So without having to enter in multiple points and drag. So again, you just want to make sure that the line tool is active. Choose the square wave and hold down the shift key and then you can make quick automation bumps just like that. If you found this video helpful, please feel free to like the video and to subscribe to the channel.